But first, we're following breaking news in North Kingstown tonight where a C-130 landed amid some tense moments. I'm Dan Janik. Good evening, I'm Patrice. Well, the landing gear wouldn't work, forcing the crew of three to circle the airport. And the night team's Olivia Fecto is live in North Kingstown tonight. Olivia? Dan and Patrice, a spokesman for the Rhode Island National Guard tells me this crew of three aboard the C-130 was doing a training exercise and that they were never in any danger. But the hydraulic system on board that plane failed and that led to fire crews coming in just in case that plane had to make an emergency landing in the bay. These photos taken from Portsmouth show a plane circling above Quonset Tuesday night. The plane appears to be the C-130 that had trouble landing. The North Kingstown Fire Department says it got a call about 7:15 that the plane had complete hydraulic failure. Lieutenant Colonel Peter Parenti of the Rhode Island National Guard tells me that controls the plane's landing gear. The plane can be landed manually if needed. In this case, Parenti says the crew circled and was able to re-energize the hydraulic system and land safely. He compared it to trying to start a car when the battery won't turn over. While this is the first time Parenti says he's heard of this happening at Quonset in the last year, he says this does sometimes happen in larger cargo aircraft or helicopters. This photo of a C-130 from the U.S. Air Force website shows a plane like the one that had trouble landing Tuesday. The North Kingstown Fire Department responded and also sent its Marine unit just in case the plane landed in the water. The East Greenwich Fire Department was also on the scene. The plane was able to land safely about 8.15 Tuesday. I asked Parenti whether this was connected to the upcoming air show, and he says it wasn't. Pilots do have to have a certain amount of flying hours, and he says this was just a typical training mission. Live at Quonset tonight, Olivia Fecto, NBC 10 News Night Team.